we're going to do a Aquarius. Ooh. Hmm. Aquarius, you could have a lot of love and help around you. Maybe you're not seeing it. Kind of just keeping to yourself right now. Tapping into your supreme energy. What's coming towards Aquarius? Someone really strong, someone who stands up for themselves, says what they need to say. Look at that goddess of sword, and then we have the five of swords. What is that? Six of swords. Give me a second. Six of swords. Damn it, man. I can't even think. Six of Swords. Mm. Okay, well. Yeah, this is someone very strong, very brave. Someone who takes life by the horns wherever they go. And someone who also puts people in their place and keeps them, you know, keeps these healthy boundaries. So this person that's coming towards you, they're very passionate. I'm seeing four of wands energy in balance. A lot of celebrations are coming towards you. This celebration, this union that's coming towards you is going to allow you to complete some sort of cycle. I'm seeing you guys at a distance. seeing recreating yourself a lot of self-reflection not using your eyes to see but your third eye with this connection that's coming um through they're they're doing that for you as well so they just completed a major life cycle and right now they're just resting and surrendering to what is, to their thoughts, to how they feel about you. And I feel that with all this feminine, nurturing, supportive energy, it allowed them to tap into their masculine energy as well and sit with their emotions that they honored and make a move. I'm seeing they see you as someone who's really rare. Someone they want to start a life with. Wow, yeah, they definitely want to have a baby with you because we have the Empress. Someone they want, you know, they see them, you're, they see you as someone they want a family with. Excuse me, by the way, you know, the frustration, I just know that there's so much. listening so maybe that's what you is maybe you too or maybe it's just on my end people telling me watch your every move you're inheriting abundance but this could actually be someone who's very rich someone who has already retired or is being stable enough to retire i'm not saying like they're like fucking 70 years old but they could be you know someone who's young someone who makes money while they sleep so they don't have to put so much hard work into things they're gonna have a lot of time and energy for you
You guys are both in alignment with each other. You're going to have a lot of time and energy for them as well. So I'm seeing because they're still at a distance, continuing to honor their emotions and seeing them feel like they don't want to rush into it. I'm seeing they're already, they already pictured it all in their head, how it's going to be, that they kind of scared themselves. And they want to put a cap on their emotions. They're trying to put a lid on how they feel. They don't wanna they don't want it to pour over. They're not wanting to express how they feel. And they're just in their feelings right now because they're doing that. Really focused on bringing the money in, I see. But it's like I already know. Okay, so that's what they could be doing. That was like a whole fantasy they had going on. And it's like the, the way that the money comes in is through you because you're abundant. Yes, look at that. The emperor right on top of the empress. It's like, what's an emperor without his empress? What's the empress without the emperor? Yeah, that's in balance. And the money not flow, the emotions not flow. And look at that. It's, ooh, having the baby. So when you guys both come together, it allows the abundance to come in. And I'm seeing somebody already financially stable, but feeling rich within, being able to actually enjoy that abundance. Giving birth to some sort of idea, some sort of plan that brings... you into a lot of financial stability even having these stable emotions as well okay where we at Aquarius stable emotions seen as they don't see you as being difficult they don't see you as diff being difficult and they they won't stop they won't leave they won't leave your side even in times when you feel like you're delaying things or I'm feeling this is the end of waiting. So continue to remain in gratitude because it's coming. Hmm. I'm feeling the energies. I just seen, I just heard you have to go to them. And then I looked at this. And it's like you're blocking that out. I feel like you felt the call that you're the one who has to make the move. And you're blocking it out. You don't want this new beginning. There's a new beginning. That new moon energy right above you. Something new. It's like you are you already healed from some sort of separation, some sort of some sort of sadness. And the only thing you're lacking is you speaking your truth you're only you're lacking your sort of truth yeah look at that holding it to yourself keeping it to yourself just trying to manifest it from afar hoping they're going to hear your telepathic calls look again just setting intentions making wishes please 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 or them to you okay because i said who's coming in but i'm seeing this possibly you and that's aquarius that's aquarius right there the star card 
Oh, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can anyone hear me? And you don't hear them answering you back because, I don't know. You know, like, telepathy, it works. It does. But I'm hearing faith without works is dead. You know, you can have all this faith that they're receiving your telepathic messages, but works, you have to put in the works as well. Go for it. Make a move. Look, you're the supreme. There's nothing to worry about. You have all the tools you need. Yeah, you have all the tools you need. And the divines also hand you another. They're like, look, we got you. If you if you don't want to carry your sword of truth, we'll hold it for you. We'll hold it for you. Mm-hmm. Beautiful. All beautiful things, Aquarius. All beautiful things. So feel it out. But don't overanalyze. I don't know. I, I just felt, no, don't feel it out. I feel like you've been feeling it out this whole time. <gasps> as soon as I said that, I was like, mm, retract. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it did have the goddess of swords. So it's like, oh, that was, that was them. That was them. That's right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. All right, Aquarius. Love you all. This is a collective reading, so it may or may not resonate if you want to book a personal reading. That information is found in the description box. What was that? Ooh, lady. Enjoy growth and reap rewards. Could be pushing your growth to the side. Not acknowledging your growth, not wanting to maintain your garden, harvest things. Oh, my eye. Or not seeing things clearly, maybe not even seeing your growth. It's like the divines are like showing you, oh my gosh, look at all these rewards, look at all this growth. And you're like, huh, where? I can't see it. Don't shoot the fucking messenger. Summer, bask in joy and light, and warrior, be fearless and stand strong. Fearless and stand strong. Being a warrior, not a worrier. This was first. Introspection. Introspection is often necessary to deepen our awareness of the unity and divinity of life. Contest. Be yourself, and you're without compare a true winner of the only contest that matters. yourself wow i just i just felt like someone said boring so then maybe you have to recreate yourself into who i don't know what the hell where's my cigarettes my bad aquarius i'm gonna light my joint while i wait i guess mm-hmm mm-hmm Conceal plans and actions from those not ready to accept you as you are. So maybe you have someone around you that's used to you worrying. And this person, you know, that you're telling that you want to be a warrior, you want to be fearless, you want to stand strong and say how you feel. Maybe they're telling you not to be yourself, you know. Okay, we're done here. Information in the description box if you want to book a personal. Love you all. Oh, shit. What was that? 
Mm. Mind your business, find your rhythm. That's what Bill. Oh, what is this? Look at my eye. Love you. Bye.